So I could draw this out and make this longer than it needs to be, but make a long story short, today is the day I take my little cousin to college. Me and Metro don't need help. Mill a pint to myself. Full of porn started ATL. Louis Goyard Bell. Well, we need to not take him to Walmart and take him to Target where he got that gift card. Well, take him to Target. They got food up there. He can spend his gift card up there on food. I don't know if they're gonna have no super target out there, but we'll see. Oh, I don't even know if they have a target. I know they can do that with Walmart. But, all right. Mm, all right. Good Be day. careful. Bye. At the gas station right now, just filled up. You know, they hit me for the $18. It's not that bad. All packed. All packed and loaded up. Ugh. So now it's time to get on the road. I catch a flight that's on the hell second. I let the chopper loose in a second. Y'all nigga listen to me like a rebel. Crave me a silver pole for a girl. I'm out here with a new guy that's testing. Kicking shit with the plug. Got the rest. My niggas ain't on stupid day. So I felt the car wobbling and shaking and shit. So I was like, man, the car feels funny. You know, it's a lot of weight in the back. And in the trunk. So I pulled over on the highway and bow. Look like he ain't going to college. <laughs> so now is the bad news. We finna have to unload the whole car. The whole trunk. Just to get to a spare tire and hope that the spare tire can hold the weight. Cause if it can't, then he really ain't going to school. Just got out of the damn discount tire. And now we literally back on road. Insert the music. Cause I'm back on road. Yeah. I still do these the same when I'm back on road. If you wasn't there for me when I was all alone, then don't expect no love. I'm just when I'm a East Atlanta with a body on his belt. Yeah. I didn't have him to the stand. He a motherfucking snitch. Big dog, big dog. Ooh. I ain't never took shit. Hey. That's all that matters. So it might be 150,000 degrees outside, but we got this boy moved into the room. The room is a regular college dorm. You know, it's pretty new. It's a brand new building. It was built in what, 2015? Yeah. And uh. Only it's two things about it that I don't like. First thing. Ain't no lock on the bathroom though. Second thing. See this? 
This is the eye hole. That's the top of the dough. That's the middle of the dough. Who gonna go like this? What the dough? <laughs> yeah, the rest of the room is pretty nice. Now we're gonna go to Target, get something to eat, and then I'm gonna get my ass back on the road and hopefully ain't no flat tire this time. Life through the phone. I was, I was, you know, me. Tell the people what you're looking for. Looking for an extra long twin bed set. And he found it. But, wow. You know, we ain't tripping because we got all the money. <laughs> so, just moved him into his dorm. This boy should come to Target trying to spend $150,000. Why? Why? Beef burrito. This little bit right here is already $50, $55 worth of stuff. I don't know, I guess you let him do what he gotta do. It's his money. I'm trying to get some of that ice cream, dude. Keep in mind, the refrigerator is not that big. You're right. Dang, what you got me doing? So, so far, he probably didn't spend about $70. You know, we ain't tripping because we got all the money. He's trying to spend more money. Watch the total at the end. I'm calling it right now. It's going to be over 80. He talking about he only need two more things. We're going to see. Somebody please tell me what this is. Drinking vinegar. So I changed my mind now. I'm upping it. It's gonna be over a hundred dollars. It's gonna be like a hundred and twelve dollars. But I just don't believe in like less than thirty goddamn tissues. Hundred and twenty two dollars. So as I thought, this boy went in there and spent $143. And watch, he don't even have enough room for it in his dorm, in his refrigerator. How you gonna fit $143 worth of food in the dorm refrigerator? He gonna find out. Did you see Navi was off the perkies, he was leaning. To take his chain, he's surrounded by the demons. He had a bunch of bad bitches lining up to me. So, let me turn this off real quick. Just got home, just got back to Hollywood anyway. Uh, a few hours ago, had to take care of some leasing office shit and some business and paperwork. But now it's time to clean. My goddamn room up. I got all these clothes to go through <sighs> to see what I can give to the Goodwill and what I'm gonna throw away. Uh, 
what I'm gonna try to sell, you know, stuff like that. But uh, yeah, though. You know, we ain't tripping because we got all of them.